Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. On the last episode, we started Snowhead Temple. Uh, so far I have yet to collect... ...any stray fairies. Or the dungeon map, for that matter. Um... Yeah, I might have to change that, but, uh, before I do anything drastic, let's head on through this door and see what lies beyond. Oh, it's this room. He did. Now, uh, hey, it's this room. He did. Okay, cool. Here's the street fairy. Good stuff. Good stuff. Now, let's see. This is the map, more than likely. This is the room that I accidentally went into earlier, if you remember. Okay, cool. Now, if we go up here... Alright, well, whatever. Let's see what's in these crates. I'm pretty sure I should be able to... No, wait, this platform doesn't even move. What am I thinking? Okay, um... Sorry about that, viewers. Okay, now, back in this room, it don't fall. Well, okay, let's fall. If you turn into a human... Now, remember how I said you couldn't get this fairy because it was blocked off by an invisible wall? Well, that's only on the front. If you shoot it from the back, which I obviously can't, just like this one, if you shoot this one, and then pull out the stray fairy's mask, you get both of them. It's good stuff. Okay, cool. Now, uh, if you turn into a Goron, the lava won't hurt you. So that's pretty cool. I apparently expect you to be missing a heart and magic when you fall down here. I was neither. Okay. So, uh, climb back up here. And that's our first two stray fairies. Good stuff. Good stuff to have. Um... Now I think I'm gonna go back to the entrance. Go through this red door here. And, uh... So it's behind, uh... Wow. I think I've already forgot where I've been. No! Well, okay. Saves me a bit of time, I guess. So let's roll through. Okay, these guys apparently pop out of the lava for no reason. Now, if you stand on that as a. Goron, a treasure chest appears randomly. Not sure what that's all about. Oh, it's a stray fairy. Good, good. Oh, that's my fourth one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. I remember now. I remember. Good stuff. They apparently expect you to lose a lot of hearts in this dungeon. Okay, I, re I know this room now. I think I know where I am. But I can't really do anything right now. 
Not here. So I don't have fire arrows, so, uh... What was the point of it? Hmm. Okay. Well, I guess I go... Well, I know this isn't the right way now. That's good. Uh, I... I'm sorry, viewers. I am completely lost at the moment. F quit doing that! Dude! One second, viewers. Okay, sorry about that, viewers. Quick cut. Kinda... Lost a little bit of, uh... Time... For reasons. Anyway, uh... If we go through here, we're back in this room. That's obviously not the right way to go. Oh, I think I know where we gotta go. Stop doing that. Please. So, um... Let's, I guess, go this way. Back to the entrance. And through this door. And we're back in this room again. Screw you. Okay. Now... I'm not 100% sure what's on that. I'll have to figure it out later. In that crate. Um... I haven't made hardly any progress, have I? Frick. Okay, well, let's just go back through. There's apparently a treasure in this room that doesn't exist. <gasps> I think I know what it is, too. If you're a kid... <sighs> Frickin' freak! Now, I think if you were to use the lens of truth, if I could line this up, oh, screw it. Blind dive. Uh, there's a treasure chest here. With probably a stray fairy. Yep. Okay, cool. Yeah. If you were to use the lens of truth, you would have uh, seen a special. Empty... Really? Okay, you know what? I am not doing this again. Freaking wrong button. I'm not doing that again. You can forget that. Um... Okay, I know what I'm supposed to do now. Okay, now, I went through this door last time. But what you should do is go over here and go... Not that. Don't do that. Okay, what you should do is go back here... And go through here. Okay, yeah, that's good. And here we have Wizrobe. An enemy that I absolutely hate. Especially since I have to target with my arrows. Really? Oh great. Now he's going to, uh, go around the room. And you won't know which one's the real one.
Unless you look for him. There we go. And then he's defeated. And he drops. And I do believe this is the dungeon item. Which would be... Could it be? I think it is, viewers. The fire arrow. Good. Good. That is really awesome to have. In fact, you need it, to be completely honest. So, uh... Let's go over here. Do-do-do. Ah! Okay, cool. cool. Okay. Okay, sweet. That's been melted. Well, let's go. Let's see what's up here. Can't do anything there yet. But you could roll over here. Oh, joy, joy. We all know I just ro love rolling places. But since there's nothing to do up here, you can go ahead and... Aw. Uh, well, whatever. Okay, now... We can, we can now stop doing that. Fudge. I'm sorry, viewers. I just really just... I'm not very good at this right now. It's... really pretty annoying. Okay, now... what you want is... some magic and some arrows. Good. Now, you can shoot these guys. There we go. Pick up the arrows, they drop. Now, uh... Okay, now by killing all them, you, uh, you unlock a treasure chest. I don't know where that treasure chest... There it is. Okay. Okay. Now... The treasure chest is... A stray fairy. Yeah, they pretty much hand you quite a few stray fairies and just... Stop... Stop hitting the torch. Please. Okay. Now... And of course, okay. Uh, I'm not 100% sure what's through this door, so I will save state, and uh, we'll go through. Okay, it's obviously another way out. Uh, now what you want to do is you want to go over there and light all the torches with your fire arrows. Um, but I will do that either off screen between episodes or on the next episode. I will see you then. Uh, thanks for watching. This has been that emulator guy.